In this video, we're going to be talking about Tubbo having nukes and what the nukes might be used for. Now, before we get into everything, please check that you are subscribed. With that all said, enjoy the video. Now, earlier today in Tommy in its streams, Tubbo came along and showed off a secret project that he's been working on for weeks. This secret project being a literal nuke. Let's talk about what they might use the nukes for. We already know that this whole project is named Dream Catcher and these nukes are kind of designed to fight Dream, but I also have a feeling they might be used on the prison. As we know, the prison hasn't been used yet and nobody's been locked up. So in the meeting tomorrow, which is Wednesday, if Turbo and Tommy fail and Dream locks them up, these nukes might have to be used. And you may be saying, how will they be used if Turbo and Tommy are already in the prison? Well, the thing is, Turbo has given a key card to Jack Manifold, meaning that he can launch these nukes as well. So if Turbo and Tommy are stuck in the prison, then Jack Manifold is their way out. But to give a massive twist on this, Nikki and Jack have actually been planning to basically betray Tommy and end up just killing him. Yeah, this storyline gets quite complicated and it's really hard to make these videos when there's so much things going on daily. The only thing is, the only other person who's part of our little commune is Tommy. Tobo has just turned around to me today and to protect himself from Dream, he's setting up a project he calls Project Dreamcatcher. It is a nuclear weapons project. He wants to test them, Nikki. What I'm thinking is if we can get Tommy in it to the coordinates of the test at the time of the test, and then me and Tobo will fire the nukes. And Tommy's gone. But let's talk more about the meeting tomorrow. Dream told Tommy and Tobo to meet up with Dream or the discs will be burnt. And Tommy has said multiple times that this will be the end. This will be the last time they fight for the discs and his plan is to basically retrieve them and that the whole disc war will be over. But we know it's the Dream SMP. No war just ends like that. And now that we have mentions of nukes, what could happen at the meeting? Well, if they're going to fire nukes at Dream, maybe Tommy and Tobo get caught in the crossfire which would be a plus side for Jack Manifold, but that would mean Tommy and Turbo have lost their last canon life. And although, personally, I don't see that happening, everything in the storyline seems to be pointing to that final end of Tommy and Turbo. But also, we know that Dream doesn't have both of the discs. A couple of streams ago, Rambo was talking to the voice in his head. And don't worry guys, I see a lot of you commenting, make a video about Rambo and his whole situation. I'm trying to, but his character is super complex. But yeah, he was talking to his other voice in his head, and that voice told him that he had the disc, which led him to looking around for it and actually finding one of Tommy's discs. Which means that because Dream doesn't have both of them, what will happen about that? Well, I feel like Rambo will end up turning up to this meeting too, and something will go down. I'm not sure whether it will be about Rambo explaining that he destroyed the community house, but I have a feeling that Rambo will be a massive part in this meeting tomorrow. But let's go off with theories and laws. I want to show you the destruction that these nukes can cause. I downloaded a mod called IC CBM and mechanism and together with these mods they allowed me to shoot off a nuke onto the ground and basically show you what this could cause. So what we have loaded up is the ICBM mod which gives us the nukes. So this is the same nuke that Turbo will most likely be using. Then there's like the stand thing that the missile has to go on for it to be launched. Then there's a dash panel thing which allows you to put in the coordinates and the energy cube which powers this all. So once we go into the panel I've already set in coordinates you just press launch and then it launches and it's it just breaks your ears. So yeah, it goes up, and then I've done it on sand so you can see a bit better of the mass destruction this thing will do. Uh, yeah. Uh, although it doesn't go too deep, maybe that was the sand which did it, this thing is a bit ridiculous. But don't worry, they haven't added a mod pack to the Dream SMP, it is still vanilla Minecraft. What they've actually done is basically grabbed a mod which has all these nukes and everything in and reskinned textures of vanilla items into the nukes. You'll see in this clip in a second that Turbo says that the nuke is actually just a wooden stick. I just want to say again for everyone, this is completely vanilla Minecraft, okay? I'll break the immersion for a second. It's literally just retextured sticks. They're retextured sticks, Jack. But look, it's a stick. It's a Minecraft stick, okay? Just to break the emerging real quick. I had a feeling that loads of you will go into the comments section and type out that the Dream SMP is going to be really bad now that they're adding mods. So I had to give this kind of disclaimer that it isn't actually a mod. It's just assets. And for all of you who already entered that comment and didn't watch the full video, shame on you. <laughs> anyway, I really hope you did enjoy this video. Make sure to leave your theories down in the comment section and that you are subscribed to the channel. Watch the other video on screen and I'll see you in the next one.